reading for the 10th to the 16th of August. I hope you enjoyed last week's uh, videos and remember we're already by the end of this coming week we will be at the middle of August and remember August is a very active and uh, strong power month there's a lot of positive things happening that's what the cards have been saying so I wonder what this week will bring and welcome back my cyber angels and thank you for your enormous support and uh, your shares and likes uh, a lot of you might be on holiday if you are on holiday please stay safe and enjoy your holiday and hope to see you back life in safety and well-being and for those that have just landed on this page hi i'm shah the cyber mum as we have a uh, live sessions as well on monday wednesday and friday so if you would like to join us in the live sessions the live sessions is the tea room known as the tea room and the followers the viewers are my cyber angels and um or cyber babes as they were known in the first early stages but they've prom I've promoted them to cyber angels okay if you would like to become a cyber angel and get a free card or have a question then I am willing to answer that so long they are supported by a super chat or a super sticker then join us on Monday Wednesday and Friday so please subscribe and hit the bell on all and then you'll be notified and I do put out extra notifications on Instagram Facebook and the community tab in YouTube there are a lot of exciting new things happening and that's why the intro is uh, slightly longer than usual um, I have done a couple of reviews and I've also um, been live for the first time on uh, cyber fair on Facebook you can see the video on that as well it was for charity and I, I am putting the link to the charity below each video this week um, as I would like to share things with you I feel honored and I am I've had a second chance after the two car accidents uh, that you all know about I have whiplash and I've come through it and um, I would like to give something back not just towards uh, anybody that's watching my videos but to more people uh, the charity is for the children that are blind but also uh, their families and the next of kin I will leave the information below please feel free don't feel um, that you have to but if you know somebody that's blind or a child with difficulties like that um, or has a parent that is blind it it does affect other family members so if you would like to donate thank you very much in advance and everything is welcome even if it is 25 cents if we all club together it can become a great whopping uh, amount and that will give them perhaps uh, a day out or a holiday or sustain them in an other way I know what it is like to be without financial aid um, this is a small charity um, I don't like to support big charities too much because they get subsidized by the municipalities and the governments or other institutions so this is um, uh, from me and from uh, uh, my viewers hopefully and this will go directly to the Royal British Society for the Blind uh, you can check it out yourself because I'll leave the link of the website underneath this video and in uh, the description box and uh, also uh, the money doesn't come to me I don't want to receive any money please pay directly into the um, association for the blind thank you very very much if you feel you can do it and you want to do it there again um, 
I'm stunned for words. I enjoyed the session. It was a life experience and you can see the video on how that went as well. And I hope to do it again sometime, hopefully next month, uh, see how things go. Let me know what your reaction is, whether you like uh, the idea that I'm doing this or have you got a suggestion of a very small uh, institution uh, or a trust that or an organization that could help uh, financial could benefit with financial help I'm willing to promote it because I'm got a, got a second chance and I'm blessed with you my cyber angels and my life and my children and my animals uh, so that's why I want to do it to a specific organization give a little bit back to society remember this is like the wheel of fortune and the world it's karma as well what goes round comes round thank you in advance and be blessed stay safe and i hope you enjoy the video ciao ciao hi sagittarius this is your reading for the 10th to the 16th and i'm charlotte and your first card is the fire guardian and that's the fire knight so news is coming to you but when this night does come in uh, act upon the news swiftly don't let it pass you by don't say oh, or think uh, I'll do that later or, or react to this later or tomorrow because then it will um, be gone it is an opportunity that's coming in or a serious letter official letter as well that you have to respond to immediately the fire guardian or knight also represents moving home. This doesn't really have to only be home, but it could also be moving in business. Okay, moving the business to another location, perhaps expansion. And you might be uh, getting official news that the um, mortgage has gone through or the loan to open up the business. The um, Knight of Fire or Guardian of Fire also represents Sagittarius, Aries or Leo. So you could be meeting one of these signs. It could also be just you that you are in your element at the moment. Okay, you are strong. In the second card in the middle of the week we have justice awesome if you might not be in uh, in balance so this news might bring you out of balance because it could be a surprise who knows uh, also um, if you are in a judicial situation then um, it could be that you are getting what you deserve justice you will get what you deserve and so will the other the justice card also represents Leo no sorry Libra um, so you could be meeting a Libra then we have the earth alpha male and that's the king of pentacles the king of pentacles is also known uh, and that he has the meters touch so everything he touches will turn to gold the king of pentacles is a Taurus but don't exclude Virgo or Capricorn that you might be meeting or you might get news from one of the signs you could be getting news from a Libra you could also be uh, getting news from an earth an, an earth sign um, the king of pentacles also represents uh, the fact that he does his research uh, when making investments like uh, an investment can be uh, in a love relationship and an investment can be in finding the right job for you yourself 
and that you might be receiving news on that because you have been looking for the right job or the right partner or the right situation and that's why you will get justice boom you will get positive news okay and something that's tangible um, will happen as well uh, if you've invested in something it is something that's tangible and with durability and for long term like a study then in the end of the week at the weekend you've got the sky puppy and the sky puppy is the page of swords now the page is of swords is Aquarius so you've got Libra here and you have Aquarius here but don't exclude Gemini in any sense of the word or the Libra with the um, sky puppy the sky uh, page of sky page of swords it could be somebody younger than you that will be bringing you news the news can come through cyber email text message or a phone call Wow that is beautiful you will get clarity that is for certain most probably clarity on an investment or clarity on an adjustment that somebody um, did to you this could be a fire sign any of the fire signs a Libra any of the earth signs or any of the water signs then we go to the healing with the angels and you have soulmates so you might be meeting a soulmate or hearing from your soulmates a soulmate doesn't necessarily have to be a partner it's like your best friend for life and you feel the same you you can finish each other's sentences because you think the same way you work the same way you act the same way the eighth secret that is the card that I have from Wayne Dyer and the treat yourself as if you already are what you would like to be accept your birthright whoa that's deep know what success and inner peace are your sorry know that success and inner peace are your birthright that you are a child of the divine and as such that you are entitled to a life filled with joy love and happiness so claim your birthright is also freedom if you have calmness and peace okay then the last color the color card you've got purple develop your mental clarity you've also got number 39 which is an 11 the angels are telling you stay calm be beautiful you're beautiful you're intelligent so accept your birthright and feel free the last card that we have is six you're in balance and it means ruling justice will be ruled and ruling yes what does ruling mean for you doesn't necessarily mean necessarily mean you can rule the nest no don't be forceful don't be forceful Sagittarius but just rule follow the rules of justice follow the rules of the law that is ruling um, luck and success and clarity and victory will be ruled for you it could be something like this if you've done an exam then there will be ruled that you have passed success is yours okay I hope you've enjoyed this reading and take care and if you're on holiday then stay safe and come back safe as well please like and share and be safe and blessed ciao ciao thank you for watching the video i hope you enjoyed it and remember have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell on all 
and I'll see you in the life. Monday, Wednesday, or Friday. Ciao, ciao.